closet organizing hangers. New year, new you. Hi guys, and welcome to Studio Knit. I'm Kristen. Today we're going to be making these artsy closet organizers that anyone can make. We will craft our closet hangers in three different techniques. Fabric wrapped, yarn bombed, and knitted. This project helps us get more organized, which reduces stress. We will learn a crafty new skill, recycle our old clothes or linens, and save money by making it ourselves. I'm thrilled to be part of Kin Community's New Year, New You collaboration. Along with my favorite DIY YouTube channels, we are all sharing our own New Year challenges and tips with you. Oh, and if you think this would be a great project to stay organized, please hit like to let me know you would like to see more crafty DIY projects like this. These hangers are perfect for straightening up multiple fashion accessories like scarves, tights, belts, neckties, and they just take up the space of one hanger in your closet. I used materials that I already had on hand, so this project was essentially free to make. An old clothes hanger, rings, I found some old plastic bracelets. Inexpensive bracelets can also be found at local thrift and dollar stores. To fabric wrap, use fabric from old clothes or linens, a glue gun, and scissors. To yarn bomb or knit, you will need yarn, size 8 knitting needles, scissors, and a tapestry needle. To make a fabric wrapped hanger, simply wrap material around your hanger. After cleaning out my linen closet, I chose an old curtain to repurpose for this project. And about every three inches, I'm dabbing a bit of glue from a glue gun to help keep it all in place. To yarn bomb our hanger, I just simply wrap the yarn and then knot the yarn together and cut the ends. I'm only dabbing glue at the very tip of the hook to keep it in place. And knitted hangers look really impressive. I've included links to all the knitting techniques in the description below. For our hanger, I cast on five stitches and then just knit a really long piece in stockinette stitch. Seam it together with your tapestry needle and yarn around your hanger. For our rings, you could do the same or create an I-cord and slip your ring through it. For my I-cord, I also cast on five stitches. Decide how you would like to arrange your rings. Then just either attach them together with yarn or fabric in whatever formation you choose. I love how our unique choice of materials, colors, and fabric give our project some really cool and original designs. It looks so polished, clean, and ready to help you stay organized. I hope you give this fun DIY project a try. And thank you so much for watching Studio Knit. Please subscribe and receive more crafty project and Valentine Day gift ideas. And make sure to check out our New Year, New You playlist for more inspirational ideas from my very talented Kin Community friends. Bye!